Hello everyone, welcome back to another tutorial. Today let's take a look at how to get your own Ubuntu terminal or your Unix terminal inside of your Windows. First off, let's just search for PowerShell. Now take PowerShell and execute it as an administrator and copy paste this uh, line of code which I have linked in the video description. Now for obvious reasons I have already done this code on my computer because if not I would I would need to restart my computer so for the sake of the video I'm not going to do that but you might have to restart your computer if you want this to work for you so now that we have that out of the way let's just search for the Microsoft Store we go to the search bar and search for Ubuntu here we go click on install so this is going to be installing in the background and uh, before we get to installing that, I want you to go to your storage. In your storage, you will have to verify that your main disk, which is in my case, it's disk C, is your main disk. If not, this won't work because Ubuntu needs to be installed in disk C for it to work. This is installed already. Let's open it. So what you will get is this. So this is going to be taking a while for it to load. Uh, so let's just fast forward a little bit. So first you will need to enter a Unix uh, username. I'm going to enter mine. Enter in a password. Repeat set password. There we go. Now we have our terminal working as, as it should. And this terminal is running like you like if you were using your own uh, Unix based computer but it's with Windows so you can do all that you would do normally in your uh, Unix of course there are some limitations but unless you're doing something very very specific this is as best as it gets and as always links to everything down in the description thank you so much for seeing me goodbye